Gold 101. Now that you know how to set your business up, it's time to learn how gold is priced and valued. Right now, I'm going to give you a basic overview and then I'll go into greater detail later in this, mod in this module. Let's begin by looking at how gold is priced. Pricing Gold Gold is priced by the troy ounce. A troy ounce of gold contains 31.1 grams while a standard ounce contains 28.3 grams. Thus, a troy ounce is slightly heavier than a standard ounce is. The going rate for a troy ounce of gold is referred to as the spot price. The spot price refers to the price that gold can be bought and sold for at a specific time. Spot prices are a lot like the stock market. They can change throughout the day. However, gold is relatively stable, so the changes aren't usually really big. Carats Carats refer to the purity of gold. 24 karat gold is pure gold. Pure gold is malleable, which means it's easy to bend because it's so soft. It just really isn't used by itself. Instead, jewels just really mix gold with other metals. Then, they look at the ratio between the gold and other metals to determine its carat value. You will need to determine the gold's carat value in order to know how much gold the item contains. When someone brings you gold, you will have to determine the carat content and the weight of the gold to actually find out how much gold you have. Once you do that, you can determine the spot price for the amount of gold you have. With that in mind, let's take a look at the carats. Then I'll go over weighing the gold. Determining the carat value There are a couple of things you will do to determine the carat value. First, you will use your jeweler's loop to look for carat markings. Most jewelers stamp the carat value in the jewelry. Looking at the markings is just a starting point, though there are counterfeit items out there, so you also have to run some tests. You can run an acid test or use your thermal electronic device to test for the purity of gold. The test will show you what the carat of gold is. Then you'll need to determine what percentage of gold you have. Carats and gold percentages. As I mentioned earlier, 24 carat gold is pure gold. That means if you have something that is 24 carat gold, it is 100% gold. There are not any other materials in the item. If you have gold with lower carat content, you will need to divide it by 24. For example, if you have 12 carat gold, you will divide 12 by 24. That will tell you you have 50% pure gold. If you have 10 carat gold, you will divide 10 by 24. We would give you 0 0.4166 or 41.7% pure gold. You need to figure out the percentage of gold the item contains after the test of carats, then you will need to weigh the gold. Weighing the gold. Once you do the carat test, you will know how the pure gold is. However, you won't know how much heavy the gold is, so you won't know how much gold you have. With that in mind, you will need to use a digital scale to weigh the gold. Once the gold is weighed, you will do some math to determine how many grams of pure gold you have. Then you do some more math to find out how much of this gold is worth. I'll talk more about this later in this module.